Hi everybody, welcome to Simply Scuba. In today's video, I'm going to be taking a closer look at the Oceanic Bungee Mount Wrist Compass. So this is a wrist compass. Obviously, it goes on your arm, comes with a bungee mount. Now, I prefer bungee mounts just because they're the elasticity means that as your wetsuit or your dry suit starts to compress as you get deeper, it's still holding on to your wrist. So your compass doesn't end just slipping around or moving anywhere and you can get it the perfect length and then just have it set that way. Let's take a closer look. So this is how it arrives uh, in, a, in a heat sealed plastic bag. Or, um, and then on the inside of which you get the compass itself and it's already fitted with the uh, with the bungee mount, which is quite nice. Um, fairly skinny bungee. Normally you get uh, sort of thicker four or five mil. This is like two, maybe three mil bungee, but it'll do the job, let's face it. Uh, it's fitted in a crisscross pattern, uh, which I quite like just because it, it acts as a bit of redundancy. You can adjust them fairly easily. It's one single piece of, um, of bungee. All you have to do is just put it on your wrist and then just tighten it accordingly. The compass itself, uh, sorry, I should say that the, uh, the mount is completely flat. Uh, so when it's actually on your wrist, it kind of sticks out a little bit. And if you're diving with a, a dry suit or something, then it'll just wrap around your wrist. So that shouldn't be an issue. Compass itself, uh, so you have this window, this little cutout, so that if you are holding it out in front of you on your wrist, um, you, you actually can't, you'd, you'd have to do it that way. So it's lengthways, so um, so that you can actually read that um, sort of going in front of you. But if you're just sort of putting it on normally as I would, then just top down view, you should be able to uh, sort of see. Rotating bezel, uh, rotates in both directions and it has that clicky ratchet so it locks in position if you have a locked bearing in mind. Uh, bright red lower line that continues down through that side window as well. And the card, the actual bit that rotates, does rotate pretty freely. It's on a, um, uh, a, a sort of a pretty tall pin and it's got a dome shape to it so it does actually rotate quite freely. All of the numbers on the dials, uh, they're going to be the like the mirror opposite of the actual bearing. Uh, so if you're looking around the side and you're confused why there's 180 at north uh, and 270 on east, it's because when you're viewing it through that side window, it's going to be the bearing that you want to follow. And uh, does it glow in the dark? Most importantly, it does a little bit. So if you shine a torch on that uh, that white card. That's going to start to glow. So if you're doing some navigation during night dives, uh, then you should be able to see where you're going. And that's the Oceanic Bungee Wrist Mount Compass, a uh, decent compass. I'd be perfectly happy using it. It's got everything that I want in a compass. It's, uh, it's relatively low profile as well. It's nice and light. Uh, it's got a little bit of rattle to it, but that's not really the, uh, the end of the world. But with that bungee mount, it just means that you do have <clears throat> a better control of sort of how it grips onto your wrist. And as much as it comes with this fairly skinny bungee, it does actually have holes that are a bit larger, so you could fit some larger bungees to it. There's going to be more information on our website, simplyscuba.com. Just click on the link down in the description below so you can check it out. Thank you for watching and of course, safe diving. Mm -hmm.